sorry that I haven't been on my channel lately because I've been busy with like schoolwork and twirling, traveling, and it's like all the stuff that's been going on. So I've tried to make as much time in between my schedule to make videos. Today's video is gonna be a makeup tutorial. Now here's the thing. I'm not the kind of person to wear makeup all the time because I have naturally beautiful skin. I like to be natural when it comes to like going out in public. The only time I actually wear makeup is when I perform for twirling. So I'm gonna make this a makeup tutorial for competition makeup style. I have, it's kind of me messed up. It's called Wet n Wild. It's like all broken, it's like old. Uh, Master Glaze, it's like the blush that I use for my uh, skin tone. I don't use liquid eyeliner. I only use roll on because liquid, it kills me. And then I have my eyeshadow brush. Actually, no, I just started the wrong way. Give me five seconds. Ugh. Never mind. Um, I don't start with eyeshadow first. I always start with eyeliner. Because if I start with eyeshadow, it's gonna, I'm going to mess up like my eyeshadow when I put my eyeliner on. Ugh. So, hello, hello. All right. So, I use my eyeliner brush. I only like to go under oh. deadly and PS I literally started putting on my makeup like last year because my mom used to do it all the time but like I don't know I didn't think I could really handle makeup because I feel like I'll go like out of control with it and stuff. But now I can put it on myself because I'm old enough. I'm freaking 16. I should be knowing how to do my own makeup. Ugh. Then, let me stand up so I can move my chair in. <sighs> then what I do is that I take the, oh my gosh, I just got. Oh. What I do is that I take the eyeliner brush and I, marker and I go over the top of my lid. I only, I only go over it once because it's going to be hard to take off later. Actually, I'll go over it more times so it can be perfect. Then I do the same thing to the other eyelid. You can cut, like, the lighting's, like, messing it up a little bit, but. All right. Now, I take the eyeshadow now. It's hard for me to do because I don't got no nails because I like to bite my nails. <clears throat> got it. All right, now we take the eyeshadow brush and I we use black first to cover the whole eyelid. I usually open my eyes so I can know where I don't get the most makeup. <clears throat> That's one eyelid, but you can barely see it because like all the light is overpowered. All right, then I take the black again and I cover my other eyelid. Got my other eyelid. Oh, <laughs> I just messed it up.
I would only do my makeup. I would never want to do someone else's because I feel like I'll mess theirs up. It'll be hard to take off of them. Ugh, it's too much work. I don't know how y'all little girls be going to school with makeup on. I mean, I don't go to makeup with. I don't go to school with makeup on. Because I'm not trying to really impress anyone. I'm just going to get an education. Duh. Now, since the black is all taken out because we drop it a lot, I take the silver. Wait, no. Yeah, I take the silver. And I take the silver. And I blend it going down the middle. So I like scribble it going down the middle. And then I usually take my finger and I blend it in. And then I take more silver and then I blend it going down the middle of this one. So you're going down the middle with like a squiggle motion. And then I take my finger again and I blend it going across the whole eyelid. Now, if needed, I usually apply a little bit more silver because with me, I'm really impatient and like I forget I have makeup on. So I have to re usually reapply silver. Then I do it again. So my eyelids look like this. They don't look perfect because like, I don't do that perfect. I take this blush right here. And for me, I have really like big cheekbones. So like, they're like really chubby. So what I do is I smile and I usually dot it around my cheekbone. <laughs> All right, that's enough. That one. I take my two fingers and I Go over a circle motion on my cheek, and then sometimes I bring it up. All right, let me do it again. again. Obviously, it's not working for me. All right, now, here's the worst part I put a making up, makeup on. When it comes to doing competition style, I hate wearing lipstick because usually I get too lazy to take it off after competitions and I fall asleep with it and then it gets dry on my lips and I have to get cocoa butter to take it off. All right, so I don't even know what color it is. It's too much work, but it looks like that color. I usually use liquid, but liquid, mm, mm -mm. I don't do liquid that much. I mean, I don't roll it on. I like to dab it because I dab it. All right. So wait, I gotta. Uh -uh. And usually when I get, sometimes not all the time. Usually when I get lipstick on the outside of my lip, I usually take a cotton swab. And I wet it. I just ooh, <laughs> I just go on the outside. Oh, wait. All 
All right, so this is what it looks like. My eyelids. Oh, this is what my whole face looks like when I compete on the floor. That is the end of my makeup tutorial competition style. If you like it, like it. If you don't, that's too bad. Um, I have to say I hit a, a hundred and forty subscribers out of all the weeks I haven't been on my channel, and that's really good. Like I'm really happy that all of you guys support me through everything I do. Um, one of my videos I hit thirteen thousand views, and I was like. Thank you. Um, make sure you comment any ideas for any videos that I should do. Subscribe to my channel, Vlon Faith, but it's actually originally Vlon. Um, make sure you share this video on any social media. So Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, Twitter. I say this all the time, so you guys know the drill. Um, so... Yeah, that's it. Um, I thank you all for watching my videos and supporting me. I love you guys. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next week. Bye.